Here we will see a question from the topic combinations. Question is very interesting, very easy, very important. Okay, so let us discuss this question. A committee of seven has to be formed from nine boys and four girls. Total number of boys is given nine and girls four. Nine plus four means thirteen. So out of this thirteen, we have to form seven commit persons committee. In how many ways can this be done when the committee consists of exactly three girls at least three girls and at most three girls so there are three parts of this question let us do one by one okay first part here total number of boys is 9 and total number of girls is how many 4 so Total altogether is thirteen, and out of this thirteen, we have to form committee of seven. So, a committee of seven has to be formed out of this thirteen. Correct. Now, in the first part, exactly three girls has to be have to be chosen. So, in how many ways we can choose exactly three girls? So, three girls can be chosen from can be chosen from how many girls? Four. In how many ways? Four C one. Sorry, four C. Three ways. Okay, but we have to form a committee of seven. We have chosen three girls only. So rest there will be boys. How many boys? Four. Then only three plus four means seven persons committee will be formed. And then four. Then four boys can be chosen from how many boys in total? Nine. In how many ways? Total is nine, and we have to choose four. So nine C four ways. So therefore, number of ways of forming this committee, forming this committee, multiplication of these two, four C three. Into nine C four, because we know that according to fundamental principle of counting, if one part of the job can be done in M ways and rest of the job can be done in N ways, then the job can be done entirely in how many ways? M into N. So if girls can be chosen in this way and boys can be chosen in this way, then the entire committee will be formed this into this. Now let us evaluate it. Four C three is equal to four factorial. By three factorial into four minus three factorial. Uh, you, you, we will use the formula. This one n c r is equal to n factorial by r factorial n minus. This is the formula of combination. So this formula will be used here. And into nine c four is nine factorial by four factorial into nine minus four. That is five factorial. Correct. Now let us simplify it. So three factorial will be cancelled out with this four factorial. So we'll get four here. Are you following this? Because four factorial is four into three factorial, and in denominator we are having three factorial into one factorial. So this three factorial will be cancelled out, isn't it? And in the second part, this is nine factorial. So nine factorial can be written as Four factorial into five into six into seven into eight into nine, and divided by four factorial into five factorial. Okay, so this four factorial will be cancel out. So and this five factorial will be five will be cancel out, remaining four factorial. Okay, so this is equal to four into. Four factorial is equal to how much? Twenty-four. So 
6 into 7 into 8 into 9 divided by 24. 8 3 is a 24, 3 2 is a 6. So, let us multiply these numbers. After multiplying it, we will get 504. This is the answer of the first part. Exactly 3 girls are chosen. Now, second part. At least 3 girls. Total number of girls is how many? 4. So, maximum possibility of girls in the committee will be 4. So, there will be 3 cases. At least 3 girls and more than 3 will be 4. So, there will be 2 cases. Case 1 will be when 3 girls are chosen and case 2 will be when 4 girls are chosen. Isn't it? Because your condition is at least 3. So, either at least 3 or there may be possibility of more than 3 also that is 4. So, 3 girls have to be chosen in how many ways? This just now we have done exactly 3 girls in how many ways? 504 means 4 c 3 into 9 c 4. So, here this is equal to 4 c 3 into 9 c 4 when exactly 3 girls are chosen and second when 4 girls are chosen, total number of girls is 4. So, that is 4 C 4 and 4 girls have already been chosen, then only 3 boys can be chosen. So, that total number will be 7, 3 boys out of 9. So, 9 C 3. Okay. So, we can calculate the answer by adding these two numbers by fundamental principle of counting by the law of addition that if a job can be done in m wage and the same job can be done by n another wage then this will be done in m plus n wage so we have to add these two numbers okay so this number is already we have calculated that is 504 and let us simplify it so you know 4 c 4 is equal to 1 into 9c3. So, 9c3 is 9 factorial by 3 factorial into 9 minus 3 that is 6 factorial. So, this 6 factorial we cancel out. 6 will be 7 into 8 into 9. Okay. And 3 factorial means 6. Isn't it? 3 factorial means 6. So, this 6 here 3 2 ja 6, 3 3 ja 9 and 2 4 ja 8. So, we are getting here 504 plus how many? 84. 84 by multiplying 7, 4 and 3 that is 84. So, uh, answer is 588. This is the answer of second part when at least 3 girls are chosen and at most 3 girls. So, what are the different options here? At most 3 girls, girls cannot be more than 3. So, there are options at least 1 girl, 2 girl or 3 girl. Okay? So, options are either 1 girl, 2 girls and 3 girls. There will be 3 options. Okay? So, one girl can be chosen in how many ways? Total number of girls is 4 and 1 has to be chosen. So, in 4 C 1. Rest, there will be how many boys in the committee? 7 has to be formed. Okay. So, number of students in the committee is 7. So, 6 boys have to be chosen from 9 boys. So, that will be 9 C 6. 1 plus 6 is 7. Now, 2 girls can be chosen in how many ways? 4 C 2. Total number of girls is 4. And we, have, we are choosing 2 girls into rest 5 will be boys out of 9. So, 9 C 5. Correct? Understanding it? Okay. And 3 girls out of 4. So, 4 C 3 
into rest three boys out of nine nine c three. Okay, and finally we will add these expressions to get the result. by simplifying we are adding here by fundamental principle of counting law of addition that if a job will be done in m wage and the same job can be done in another n wage then this job will be done in m plus n wage so this formation of committee is here complete formation of seven students committee is formed here uh, similarly seven is formed here sorry this will be 9c 4 since we have selected three girls and remaining four boys will be selected out of nine boys so by solving these expressions we will get the answer and we have seen how to evaluate factorial of numbers so just you try this and after solving it you will get the answer that will be 1632 this will be the answer of this third part of the question okay question is very interesting so understand try to understand the solution and do some more practices of similar pattern of questions okay fine